That's man's one privilege over all creation. Through error, you come to the truth. I'm a man because I err. You never reach any truth without making 14 mistakes, and very likely 114. And a fine thing, too, in its way. But we can't even make mistakes on our own account. Talk nonsense, but talk your own nonsense, and I'll kiss you for it. To go wrong in one's own way is better than to go right in someone else's. I loved her simply because I found her irresistible. Once for all, I knew to my sorrow, often and often, if not always, that I loved her against reason, against promise, against peace, against hope, against happiness, against all discouragement that could be. I love her nonetheless because I knew it and I had no more influence in restraining me than if I had devoutly believed her to be human perfection. There was a deliberate voluptuousness that was both thrilling and repulsive. And as she arched her neck, she actually licked her lips like an animal till I could see in the moonlight the moisture shining on the scarlet lips and the red tongue as it lapped the white, sharp teeth. Lower and lower went her head as the lips went below the range of my mouth and chin and seemed about to fasten on my throat. Then she paused and I could hear the churning sound of her tongue as it licked her teeth and lips and could feel the hot breath on my neck. I closed my eyes in a languorous ecstasy and waited, waited with beating heart. He knew that when he kissed this girl and forever wed his unutterable visions to her perishable breath, his mind would never romp again like the mind of God. So he waited listening for a moment longer to the tuning fork that had been struck upon a star. Then he kissed her. At his lips' touch, she blossomed for him like a flower, and the incarnation was complete.